What's up guys, welcome back. My name is Sean and today... Oh, who loves the flow of this? Shoo oh. up! The emotion, the power... And then it just explodes! <laughs> okay. What's up guys, welcome back. My name is Sean and today we're going to be reacting to Heejin with Sad Girls Club and Video Game. So guys, we are back with some more Heejin getting into two of the B-sides from her K album, getting into Sad Girls Club and Video Game. Now, we are not taking this in the order of top to bottom within this album because apparently on her uh, channel or on the Artemis channel, I believe it is, we have these two uh, songs that actually have showcase versions, which I believe, believe is because she performed these two songs at the... Um, well, the K album release showcase. So that's why we're checking these two out first because they have showcase versions. And then for next time, we'll be checking out the rest of the pieces in this album being Flower Nokia and Addiction. So that's why the order is a little bit different from what we're used to doing here on the channel where we normally just do it from top to bottom. This time we're doing it a little different. We are taking the showcase version. So I'm thinking, I'm excited. Let's get right into the first one, Sad Girls Club. Okay. Lovely, very soft vocals. It's kind of like soft and sharp because of, because of the nasal. That part is really nice. Da, 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 da. Mm. The vibe here is immaculate. Mm, wow. I think the backtrack is a little loud, but like, outside of that, this is really good. Well, not the backtrack, like, yeah, back backtrack, the ad libs. Mm. I'm just loving this relax, almost like. Driving in the evening or midnight kind of vibe. Imagine driving home to this song. Goddamn. Wow. I actually thought that was the outro, but no. We're getting this last chorus here. Mm. Ooh, that shine there at the end. God damn. That mm. girl's club. Sad Girls Club. God damn, that was uh, 
That was Heechin with Sad Girls Club, a really, really nice and kind of relaxing song here. It feels like, yeah, there's a little bit of a, well, I guess from the title, a, 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 a sad emotion in this one because it is a little bit more slow. But what I actually really like about this song is how it fits perfectly to those almost, it, well, it's almost got like a lo-fi like beat to the, um, to the actual song. Like it's very, very lo-fi like, but it also just reminds me of something you could, you know, you could kind of cruise to like in, at, at night in the middle of the night or like at least when it's dark out and you have all of the lamp posts you can just imagine kind of cruising nicely on the highway with the lamps kind of flying by to this song like no matter what speed you're cruising at this song will just relax you will keep you calm and well I, I, I'd recommend cruising you know within the, the legal limits but you know still it, it just feels like the perfect song to kind of return return home to like it, it's kind of like a a well albeit not a Christmas song it, it's kind of like a driving home for Christmas kind of song where it's it's one of those where you're like yeah you, you're chilling you, you really really want to listen to this especially when it's dark out when as you are returning home that's that's so nice but we've got one more to check out for uh, for now let's go right into video game Okay. Oh, more power behind the vocals this time. But the instruments are still being kind of slow. Kim is going slowly. Okay. Corey looking dope. Like, I really love the small details. Ooh. Hey, okay. And they're really like using all of their body for the for the choreo. That's nice. Ooh, okay. Like video games, sure. Got him. What is this gonna break down? Ooh, that was kind of dope. That post chorus there. Okay, I, I like the like parallels of this song to uh to algorithm. That was Hygian's video game. I really like how well how it, it actually kind of fits in with the with the theme of uh, of the album, at least with the um, with the title track as well. It being algorithm, but algorithm talking about how you should throw your window, not your window, throw your phone out the window. This one kind of the opposite, being well, you should keep on playing your video game. It kind of feels like the uh, the album is talking about both the the good and the bad of, of being kind of either stuck with the with the algorithm, but also e like playing video games. Like yeah, 
yeah, you, yeah, you, 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 obviously you'd want to stop playing video games so we could be together, but sometimes I kind of need this alone life, so I, I need a little bit of time alone, so you, you know, just go ahead, play your video games, I'm not completely sure that's what the gist of the song is, but that's at least how I'm going to interpret it, I really like this song, it, it feels like a really, really cool kind of kind of, I, oh, I, I'm not sure I'd say middle ground, but it kind of feels like a middle ground between Algorithm and Set Girls Club. We have a beat that is a little bit more slow, that has a little bit more of a of a trappy hip beat while still being kind of slow, but the way that she's singing and also it being a, a, a choreographified song, it actually fits a little bit more into Algorithm, and it feels like a very, very natural kind of progression from one to the other, like Set Girls Club, video game, Algorithm in that regard, and I like that a lot. I really like this song, how it kind of makes is some really really good things into it like a really nice choreography some very very nice vocals while still having this slower kind of relaxing beat that's super dope but yeah guys that was Hygian with Sad Girls Club and Video Game both of which were showcase versions absolutely love this I especially really like Video Game with the choreography and everything that just looked very very soothing like one thing is the instrumental being soft kind of slow kind of relaxing but also the actual choreography very very fitting uh, very fitting into it that does really make sense but fitting a lot in with that kind of soft more relaxing part of the um well of the instrumental it being a little bit more of a soothing choreography is super super cool but despite it following this slower melody this slower beat there were still a lot of sharp movements a lot of big movements she's using all of her body in this choreography which i think is super super clunch i mean she's executed it on, on point like absolutely on point and the song itself is super dope like and one thing is the instrumental but the vocals that are showcased these deeper vocals that that Hijin is kind of known for her having this deeper tone this deeper vocal set they, they really really shine throughout their song like this where we are singing within this this I guess lower register I really like that but let me know what you guys thought about Hijin's Sad Girls Club and video game showcase versions down in the comments below and I guess I'll see you guys next time <laughs>